Here is the original model where we have Skylight Group opening and we have grouped it and then converted the original model into a car park space where we have placed a parapet wall and car opening lines and also the colors for the map. Let's paint some colors also on this driving. Let's just use the modify into Let's continue with the practice slide and let's paint the roadway with a different material. Let's say it's a asbestos or asphalt bitumen, so it can be in a different color. Now, we can also add in some models uh, such as cars, we can play some cars here but these models does not come preloaded with graphics so you have to download it from a developer's course and make sure that the file size is not that huge so it doesn't clutter or uh, interfere with the performance of your model uh, Fortunately, I have some models which is for cars so we can insert something uh, use the insert load family in here we're going to uh, here is the family is preloaded but there's no cars here so now it's in the entourage let's go here there's a detail RPC let's insert it try to use this one it's a 2017 part so we have to update it so now let's go to architectural component place a component will be listed here. Hope I will have mocks here. So I don't have the other families, but let's try it. It's much easier to do. Let's place it. Let's just place it somewhere here. Then we can move it later. So now there is a car park in our model. So let's see. Let's, you can select this and copy it. Copy. Let's say it's, we want to place it here. Then we want to rotate it. Rotation. We place the rotation here. So we can rotate it. Degrees. Okay, so now the car is moving downwards, so it's going out of the building. So let's, let me see if I can still find some cars, car models, which may I, I can show you how to place it. Looking at some of the files, I think in, uh, there are preloaded cars model or truck model in Revit we just need to go to the English Imperial library and then go to Antaraj there is a semi truck you see here cannot place it there let's use a click open and let's see how it models to go to place component select the band then we place it somewhere can have a feel and look of how spaces will be utilized. If you want to add in more models, you can download some uh, in some website where they have all these uh, 3D models pre-created so you don't have to create or model any of these cards. Have a look. 
So that is how to place additional models such as cars in the So okay, this one will cost me at level 2. Let's go to level, let's go to section duties. You can still move this. If you have that problem, click here, move. From here, you can push it. That is how to move it if you have accidentally created the different level, level or elevation. Let's go back to 3D. See? And then we need to shift it along the plane. So it's in the doorway. So that is how to model a much easier we can place somewhere here also let's place one let's go to the next so you can see it's done here so select it modify move select the select the move the select the move command we we'll place it on this table then we can rotate it, select the place point, then we can roughly align it. Create place point. Unfortunately, this could not be rotated into the inclined position. So we have to abandon this. Just click to with what we have. I'll see if I can get some models which can be placed on this inclined plane. Inclined plane today. Thank you.